Hey guys, Karen Wolf here in the art studio again this evening. How are you all doing? Oh. I am a painter and I teach you how to paint and become a better painter in an easy to follow step-by-step -step process. And I do that online. Uh, in my uh, memberships, I have virtual painting classes um, that I uh, have on my website. And I paint live on here, my Facebook page. Actually, I go live on YouTube occasionally. I plan to do that more often. And uh, I've gone live in uh, Instagram once. <laughs> I'm not real tech savvy with that Instagram thing, but I do plan to um, venture out and go live in both of those places, uh, as well as continue the Facebook page lives here as I do on Usually Mondays and Tuesdays, or Mondays and Thursdays, but I'm thinking about changing up my Monday. Oh, there went my paintbrush flying across the room. Um, yeah, I'm just, I don't know. I'm thinking about changing my Monday. Well, there went another paintbrush. So, um, not sure what day I'll do that on. Um, I go live on Thursday, Mondays and Thursdays. Um, let me grab this paintbrush real quick. It's driving crazy already. <clears throat> but, uh, yeah, I'm not sure. So, anyhow, this evening we're going to paint, um, the backside of a bunny. <laughs> so, I'm not sure who, who I have on here yet because I can't see, um, I can't see if you're on here unless you, uh, say hey. So, uh, when you jump on, if you're on here watching, if you would just say hi, hello, um, watching from wherever you're watching from would be great. Uh, so I know, um, where you're, where you're watching from. A lot of, a lot of folks that jump on here are from different states. Um, I'm live in West Virginia right now, but I have people that jump on here from Tennessee, Ohio, Oklahoma, uh, Wisconsin, uh, New Jersey, I have lots, lots of different, uh, <clears throat> lots of different places people are watching from. So, I'm going to try and pull this up on my iPad here so I can see. But we're going to paint, I can get this in close enough for y'all to see. And hopefully, um, I know I've just been going on and on and on about this for weeks now. But hopefully my internet holds out. Um, my cell, um, service is just a little sketchy, uh, here lately. I just cannot figure out what the problem is. I've called, <coughs> excuse me, I have called, um, Verizon and tried to find out what the deal is and they keep telling me 72, hey Tammy. Hey Nancy, welcome, 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 ladies. Um, and if you're if you're watching on the replay, let me know you're watching on the replay too. Um, that is uh, that's great because then I can see, like I said, who's watching. Um, but um, they keep telling me forty eight to seventy two hours, and that was four or five weeks ago. So, I'm not sure exactly what the deal is. Um, then a one lady told me it was my phone. Well, I know it's not my phone, honey. Because I get service when I'm out other places, not around my house. But whenever I'm here is where the service just disappears. And it's... <clears throat> uh, we used to have four bars all through the house and four bars, you know, up on my back deck. I walked out the other day went up on the back deck I, I do good to get three now two uh, most days and sometimes one so uh hey stacy how are you i hope you've been painted painting painted <laughs> not painted uh just started a new job so you need to get settled in and then you'll be able to join me more oh okay yeah new jobs are great aren't they <laughs> sometimes all right so i'm gonna paint this little bunny, and I'm just, I'm going to experiment on what color will show up here. Um, I have a gray board, so I'm just thinking I may do like a white bunny, 
and I'm going to go in and shade it first. I'm going to go in and paint it first with like um, a brownish uh, color. So I'm not sure yet. This is another one of those um, online experiments. Um, and like I said, I hope the internet, um, the daggone, yours is awful too. Um, Myra, I, I have, um, like I said, I have Verizon. I was on AT&T for years. I had AT&T since like the beginning of time, uh, back in the olden days when, almost when I didn't have one of those, when the bag phones, <laughs> anybody remember a bag phone? A cell phone that was in a bag. Uh, it was almost back that long ago. Um, but I didn't have one of those. Um, but it was back when, you know, the bigger cell phones and all that. Um, but this color that I'm using here is burnt sienna. Um, a little bit of blue and white. And I am painting with a half inch flat. And this is on a board, a little piece of wood that is seven inches wide and nearly, it's just an eighth of an inch from 12 inches. So there's that. And I'm using acrylic paint. Um, but I, I had um, AT&T for 100 years and I... Um, I just couldn't deal with it anymore because our service was horrible here. I did never have enough signal after we had gotten the metal roof. We just didn't have very good service and signal, uh, in the house. And I just, uh, ended up, my son switched to Verizon and when he would come over, he would have service. Jacob would have service in the house. And I'm like, why? How are you doing that? How are you having service in the house? And I don't. Well, it's because he switched to Verizon. So, um, I switched to Verizon, had great cell service, and uh, love, love, loved it. Now I'm just adding white, and uh, no problems. Still not the greatest. I mean, we went up to like three, two, and three bars, whatever, but it wasn't enough for me to do lives here at home. So when I closed the art studio down and I started doing lives and they were uh, lagging, <coughs> excuse me, I had to do something. So I got a Wii Boost to pull the, the signal of four bars that I had outside on my back deck. They said if you have four bars outside or whatever service you have outside, the Wii Boost will pull it in. So uh, I did that. And, um, for six months, I had four bars all through my house. It was a dream. It was like, a, you know, it was heaven. It was heaven on earth to have go from horrible cell service to four bars all through your house. Especially when I'm doing lives and, you know, you guys want to see what I'm doing here. You don't want it to be lagging. Hey, Gina. Welcome, hon. So, um, the service was great. Six months. We Boost is the most awesome thing in the world. It pulled the signal, the cell um, signal in my house, four bars all through the house. And then all of a sudden, about, let's see, I'm guessing this is the fifth week of this nonsense. So, I'm just adding more white. Just adding more white to to lighten this bunny up some. And I'm just up and down, up and down, up and down. And I'm leaving this side over here darker. Because I want him to be darker over here. Um, so, um, for about five weeks now, it was when I did my, my workshop is when, of course, the problem started. It always happens when I have a launch or my workshop. So, I call 
It's your phone. I call. It's your uh, too many people using the tower. It's it's a you know congestion. It's you know whatever. It's switching to four five G. It'll take forty eight to seventy two hours. And let me tell you, it's been longer than forty eight um, seventy two hours. So there, ran over. I still don't have cell service, and I'm, I apologize for the lag. So there's the bunny. Uh, hey, Brenda. Hello, friend. Hey, Susan. Hello, hello. Thank you all for jumping on here this evening and putting up with me, running my mouth. But I'm so tired of the cell service not being good. I want my old four bars back. I would be satisfied with three at this point. Then I'm just adding more white. And I got into the blue, and I didn't mean to, but I don't care. I don't care about that. Okay, so I'm just adding more white to bump up this little bunny. Making it look like he's more white. Just bumping him up a little bit. Isn't he cute already? So this is the back side of the bunny. Hey, Tanya. Welcome. Hello, my friend. All right. Um, this is the cutest thing. This is just so cute. I just love bunny butts. I just think bunny butt pictures and paintings. And I don't know what it is about the back side of a bunny is so cute. Y'all agree? <laughs> Put in the comments if you think a bunny butt painting is cute. It just is. It is, it is, it is, it is. They're, um, they're easy to paint. There's not a whole lot to it. Um, and they're just adorable. They're just adorable. And you could make the bunny, yes it is Brenda, isn't it? And you can make the bunny, uh, fat, short and fat, tall and skinny, uh, you can make a gray bunny, a brown bunny, a white bunny. Sky's the limit. Sky's the limit. So, there you go. Do y'all hear, um, hear my latest news? I am having a live sale soon. And this little guy right here will be in it. So... If you haven't heard, now I'm just adding more white, just for those of you who follow me and are learning to paint from me. I hope everybody is. Um, just adding some more white to lighten up. This bunny. Making him white. Want him to be a white bunny. <clears throat> and this is something that you all, anybody can do this. You all can do this. Trenton's is gray. His is gray. Um, yeah, he could do um, either uh, for simple, just to keep it simple, he can use black and white to make gray. Or you can use the, you know, the burnt sienna, the blue, um, ultramarine blue and the white to make a gray. This color looks gray. Looks, this is like a, a bluish gray and this is like a gray color. And I'm just, I just keep just touching in just with my brush. I'm just touching in, um... Just soft, just soft, touching in the white. But the live sale is coming up Thursday, April the 14th. I scheduled, the, uh, scheduled it on Charlie's birthday. I do not know why I did that, but we'll have, we'll just have to be quick. <laughs> Charlie is my granddaughter. Uh, her birthday is uh, that day, so um, she'll be two. 
asked her how old she's going to be, and she says, two, how old are you going to be on your birthday, two, kids are so cute, love them, love them, little bugger was sick today, and Henry actually wasn't in the greatest shape, they're both, they were both fighting it, too much stuff going around, Trenton's little uh, bunny is cute, uh, Tanya. It's like, um, it's an inside uh, pet, isn't it? It's like ha having a little puppy. So then I'm just adding more white. More white. Just touch, touch, touch. Just see, every time I duck, I'm just building up. Acrylic is just layers of paint, guys. Acrylic paint is just layers and layers and layers and layers. Just building thin little layers of paint. And it's so fun to see it come to life. It is just so fun to see it come to life. Love it. <clears throat> Pam said, just caught you on this live. We had to get a new modem for our internet today because the old one was too old to handle the 5G. The company has started sending out. Just putting this out there. Well, you know, um, I don't use a modem, though, on my iPhone. It's my... It's my iPhone that I'm having trouble with. And I asked him if it was, is it my phone not compatible with the 5G? And she said it should be, because she checked it, and she said that it was, that mine and my husband's phones are compatible with the 5G. Well, when I go, when I drive out the road to, uh, the, I live four miles from the interstate, from I-77, and when I drive out the road um, to the interstate, I get four bars once I get out to the interstate. Now, sometimes those four, four bars will hit, you know, down the road here just a couple miles from my house. But most of the time, it takes me until I get to the interstate to get them. Then when I go to Ripley, I've got practically, you know, hit and miss service all the way to town on Route 21, but by the time I get I get to Fairplane and Ripley, I've got four bars again, full four bars all in town. So, uh, it's not my phone, and it can't be a modem, um, Pam, because I am not. It's not coming through a modem. It's my phone. It's cell service. I know I call it internet, but it's it's my cell phone. It's my it's my signal. So I don't know. It's a frustrating thing. You know, we just depend so much on technology. Um, but I need it for my I need it for my business and it's really starting to get old. really starting to get old for me, so I'm sure it's really starting to get old for you guys, too. <laughs> so, enough of that, though. I just need not complain. There's there's other things going on in the world that's worse than not having cell phone service. Okay. All right. So, there's a, a lot of white coming in. I'm bumping the white up on this, uh, on this rabbit, but I think I'm going to put a little bit more dark into getting a little, uh, a little darker on that one side. Sometimes you have to check to see if all your updates are good. Um, yeah, I did that too, Stacy. I did the whole uh, whole shebang one evening with Verizon. They took my phone back to the original um, or whatever they did. They did the update thing. And, oh, my gosh. I thought I'd just go bonkers because it messed up all my settings and stuff on my phone. I had to redo 
a whole bunch of stuff. You know how you, it's almost like taking your phone back to when you first bought it, and then you have to... I'm just darkening this side up over here just a little bit, just to, so my white shows up more. Um, <laughs> it was awful. It was like, oh my gosh, mister, you done messed me up. You took my phone all the way back to the beginning of time. Now I got to redo everything. But I think I've about got it back to where it was. But we're spoiled plum rotten is what we are, aren't we? Anybody else? We're just spoiled. Spoiled, spoiled rotten. So I just pulled that a uh, little bit darker up on that one side because I just felt like I just didn't have enough uh, dark there for my white to show up. So now I'm going to go back in with a little bit more white on that. Uh, boards are so much more, uh, they're so different to paint on. So if you ever paint on wood, it dries way faster than um, canvas. So if you think canvas dries fast, my word, you should paint on this. It's like lightning speed drying. I keep getting a line there, I'm sure. Hey, Violet. Welcome, my friend. There's Kathy. Hello, hello. Tony. Appreciate y'all jumping on. Appreciate it. Um, but I will look, uh, Stacy, and see if I do have the updates. But I'm, I'm, he went through all that. But I'll check it again. Um, if it's something as simple as an update, holy moly. Right. Okay. So there's, I, I built that rabbit up um, near is about as white as I'd like for him to be. He or she or it, whatever it is. You keep calling it a he. Could be a she. All right. And like I said, this is just a simple, just to show you how to paint uh, the backside of a bunny. The back side of the bunny. Afraid if I say bunny bud on there, they're liable to shut me down. All right, I think I want to do um, a tail. Um, like, um, I was going to do kind of a tail with some pink in it, just for fun. I know that's not realistic. Bunnies don't have pink tails, do they? And his tail wouldn't be that big, probably. I just went into some white. And made him a tail. I think I'll leave it, leave it white. I think that'll be fine. I was going to make it a little bit pink, just for kicks and giggles, but... I don't think so. I think I want this to be kind of, um, you may have missed it, but how do you make it look fluffy? How did I make what look fluffy, um, Violet? The bunny or the tail? The bunny, I've just been taking the, the brush and just hitting it just like that. Just flick, 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 just down. Just taking kind of like the side of my brush and just, and that's just a little bit more white, just more, just brighter white. Just keeping it a little dark down here in the bottom, and most of the white is on the, the side there coming down. Um, but I just took the, I'm just really painting with this, these, this many brushes on my brush. I'm just kind of taking the side of my brush and just, can you see that? Just kind of going tick, 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 tick. Tick. You like those sound effects? Tick, 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 tick. <laughs> just like that. Just kind of, and then kind of smoothing it out here and there. You don't want it to look real rough, but that's what I did. 
I started out with blue, sienna, and white as my gray color. And just build it up as I go. So, but life sales coming up. And then the tail, I just took the, the white and the dirty brush that I had and I just kind of, uh, just kind of went like that. Just kind of poked at it. Um, the live sale's coming up Thursday, April the 14th, 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I will go live here on this page. Hopefully my internet holds out. <laughs> my cell phone service holds out. And I can't use Wi-Fi uh, because we have Dish Network and it's worse than uh, my cell service. So we're just kind of stuck between a rock and a hard place. So to get a little bit more white, a brighter white, you can take just a small amount so you can't even see the yellow. I need to rinse, I got too much yellow. You can take yellow and white. You're welcome, Violet. Yep, small short strokes. Little tap tap, kind of like ch -ch 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 -ch. Just keep building up um, layers and layers and layers. And it's just a little tip tap tip tip tip. Just tap tapity tap. Uh, to get a really bright white, take a tiniest bit of yellow in your white to where you can't even see that there's yellow, but the yellow's there. And you just touch in. And that... Um, makes a really bright white. You can use that. I've shown you that on daisies. Anything that you paint white that you want it to really pop. If it's not, just take that white, yellow, and not so much yellow that you can even see the yellow. You don't want to see the yellow. But that up on top of the gray will look very bright. Will look like a very bright white. And if you don't have, if you don't have um, your gray underneath, then you're gonna have problems. So you need to um, make sure you have gray underneath first. So there's the bunny. Um, going to put in some grasses and stuff. So I'm gonna dry it real quick. So y'all say, hey, when you jump on here so I can see who's watching. And if you're watching the replay, uh, let me know you're watching the replay. And love you forever. All right, I'm going to dry that a little bit. Like I said, I just really, um, I really didn't know what I was going to paint to begin with. And I know I tell you guys that all the time. I come on here and I'm like, I have no clue. I just come on here to paint. And um, show you guys how to paint stuff. But I um, just love the bunnies, the box out of the bunnies. And thought this would be something fun to, to do. And um, I really didn't have in mind anything. Any idea what I was going to paint around it, but I do know I want to put a little bit of grass down here at the bottom. Just go in with some some grass. I'm just using acrylic paint is what I'm using, and what I'm using is actually just these several paint plates that I have here because I just finished up recording my lives for my 
online virtual painting tutorials. I finished up the the barrel of flowers up there. Anybody y'all y'all see that? Barrel of flowers. The truck is is new. Yeah, just finished those up. Added them to the online painting tutorials library, and they are available uh, for the all access members to paint. They're available for the pick your painting club uh, folks. So yeah, lots of lots of fun stuff going on here. I record. Uh, painting tutorials that come with um, template, supply list, video, and you can purchase those on my website. Um, of course, I do a lot. Of, I do a lot of painting on here too. But if you want to get the templates, if you want to get the extra fun stuff, all of the cool information, all of the inside secrets, paint with me online on my, either in one of my memberships, pick your painting club, um, all access membership, or the painting tutorials that you can purchase. It's keeping this one simple, not, not complicating it at all. Just a little bunny sitting in the grass. Isn't that cute? Little bunny sitting in the grass, just waiting for a carrot or something. <laughs> just waiting, maybe for its little friend. Really, it's just a demonstration for you guys to see how to know how to paint a bunny. So, um, but anyhow, uh, hey Sandra, Paulette, welcome. Hello, everyone. Welcome, and thank you so much for joining this evening. I did w go in with um, green and purple for the darker grass. I just went into um, green and a little bit of purple and made a dark green for that green grass that I just did. Just some... Uh, keep it... Um, a little bit, um, of water, like liquid in your, or not liquid, uh, but if your paint's like scooting across and it's not, um, painting like, if it's not the consistency of like smooth, creamy, you know, butter that's like melted in the dish, uh, you know. The melted dish butter. I don't know if y'all do that or not. A lot of people just don't do that, but we do. Um, but when you've, not when you've stuck it in the microwave and you've ruined it and melted it down to water. Not that thin. <laughs> the, the butter that's set out and a stick of butter that's set out in just room temperature and it's just soft and creamy and you just put that thing on your, you put that butter on your biscuit and you, a little bit of honey or jelly and you're good to go. All right. So there is the bunny, um, I think in the, the grass there. I think that's a good one, don't you? Um, we could probably add some other things to it maybe, um, that would make it look really, you know, you could do, I don't know, um, butterfly, eggs, um, different things uh, to cuten it up a bit. But I think that's what we're going to do this evening. We'll, we'll do that. If y'all come up with some other ideas and uh, let me know in the comments and we'll, maybe we'll add that to it um, 
on Thursday. How about that? Oh, thank you, Violet. Thank you very much. Um, I think it's cute, too. I, I like it. I think it turned out real cute. I get on here sometimes, and I just go in and paint things, and sometimes it's like, what in the world? <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm going to paint. Well, I know what I'm doing, but I don't know what I'm going to paint. And sometimes, you know, it's one of the best paintings that I'll, in, you know, that I'll paint. Just, it's funny. Uh, I used to never do this. I used to never come on here and paint something without knowing in advance uh, what I was going to paint. I would always have an example. I would always have something to go by. Um, ahead of time, I would have always, you know, painted the painting in advance. And the first time that I came on here and painted, um, live without a, an example, I can't remember if it was a palette knife painting or if it was just actually a painting. Uh, oh, thank you guys. Thank you, Natalie. Hello, Natalie. And, uh. Thank you, Tanya. Thank you guys so much. Um, but I can't remember. Um, I like that too. I think it turned out pretty cute. Pretty cute. And it's um, it's got some chalk on there. Let me clean that off. A little bit of... We'll get that. Get rid of that. Um... And I'm just leaving that gray background. That Actually, that board was, was like a shell. <laughs> it was a piece of uh, shelving that, that I had upstairs in uh, my son's room. Uh, there's a, lot, a bunch of uh, uh, paintings, some of the paintings for the live sale coming up, you guys. The live sale will be Thursday, like I said, Thursday, uh, April 14th at 7 o'clock. Um, 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. A live sale. I come on here. If you want to be notified when I'm getting ready to go live, where's my thing? Best thing for you to do is get on the text list. If you want to be notified when I'm going live so you don't miss that live sale, text Let's Paint to 304-245-9690. To You'll get a text notification like a minute or two before I go live and you'll know the I'll say live sale is getting ready to happen. Get on the stick. <laughs> I'll say I'm getting ready to go live to, to do a live sale. So that is one way that you can be notified. In my eye. Um or you know, go out, like my Facebook page and make sure that you're set up following and uh, receiving notifications so that when I go, go live, you receive the notification or set your alarm <laughs> on your phone that says at 7 o'clock, Karen's going live. Because in the past, my live sales have been um, an hour, a little over an hour. Um, but the last time I had one, I did a, I think it was a 20 paintings sale. Uh Maybe it was 10. 20 paintings. What it's going to be is 20 paintings or more in 20 minutes. Whatever I can do in 20 minutes. If it's 20 paintings or it's 25 paintings, uh, it's 20 minutes and it's it's going to be over. Um, because an hour is a long time for a sale. Um, it makes it a lot of extra work. I mean, I had over 100 paintings. It's a, it's a big job. And, um, it's a lot of time for you guys to sit and watch a live. So, it's going to go fast. I mean, it's going to be 20 minutes or, um, you know, 20 minutes, 20 paintings or more in 20 minutes. And I'm going to hold up a painting and say, and this is going to be in it. Uh, here you go. Uh, and it may be changed by then a little bit. I don't know. I might add something to it. Never mind. <laughs> But anyhow, I'll say, uh, here you go, number whatever it is, uh, and you have to comment, like this is, say this is 100. Uh, you have to comment 
uh, sold 100 in the comments, and whoever does it first, whoever comments first, has first dibs. Now, if that person doesn't buy it, if that person doesn't pay within the 24-hour period of time, then it goes to the next person. So, you've got 24 hours to pay. You, um, if you, I'll invoice you for it, and then if you don't pay, um, then it goes to the next person. So, um, it, it's a pretty easy thing. It just, boom, 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 and it, it goes, um, but it's a lot of fun. I'm sure it's nerve-wracking for you guys. <laughs> it's fun for me. I enjoy it, um, but a lot of people participate in them, so um, what it consists of is the paintings that I have uh, painted in the last few months, so um, what, what, like, when I go here and I do a demonstration painting live on Facebook or I record uh, the basket of flowers like I was showing you, I recorded the basket of flowers up here, barrel of flowers up here behind me. I just recorded that and I just recorded that. Well, when I record, I have a painting and I have my original. So in order to move those out of here and get rid of them, I have live sales. So, um, if you've seen a painting, uh, the blue door, um, the paintings that I recorded for, um, March will be in there. So, if you've seen paintings that I've been recording and you think that you would like to purchase one of those, that's what I have in the live sale. Paintings, um, start, uh, like, I think they start at $10, $15 and they go up to 25 and then some of the wood pieces are um, a little bit more but um, yeah very affordable buy them for yourself get them for your friends you know Mother's Day is coming um, they make great birthday gifts or like I said keep them for yourself <laughs> a lot of people do that all right um, but it's fun so it's real fun so if y'all have any questions about that I'd be glad to answer them um, see what else um, how many paintings are you going to have in your sale? Um, Stacy? like I said, I'll have, um, and you may have asked me that before I answered, or uh, before I answered a little bit ago, but it's 20 paintings or more in 20 minutes. So, um, if, at you know, if 20 paintings and I've, it's 10 minutes or 20 paintings and it's 15 minutes, whatever time I have left, I'll keep, um, pulling the paintings up and adding to it um, to finish out the 20 minutes for the sale. So it's at least 20 paintings, but it could be more because um, they go pretty quick. Um, it doesn't take very long to, to work through, through them. Um, so I'll definitely probably have more than 20. Um, I showed a, a sneak peek um, Sunday. I showed a sneak peek this morning. Uh, every day I will be showing, um, some sneak peeks of some of the paintings that will be, um, in the sale. So keep your eyes open for that. And like I said, uh, when I go live, when I come on here and I paint live, um, chances are that painting is going to be in the live sale. So, Lots of fun lot, and a great opportunity for you to um, grab some really cute paintings, uh, like I said, for yourself or for gifts. They're really, um, really cute and very inexpensive. Very, very inexpensive. So, um, I think that's it. Um, so, you all have a wonderful evening. Like I said, do not uh, forget about this. Definitely jump on this one. If you want to be notified when I'm getting ready to go live for the live sales, for when the membership is opening, the all-access membership is opening, um, for coupon codes, um, when I'm going to go live on here to paint something like I did this evening, when I, when I went to go live this evening, I sent out a text to my folks uh, that are on my text list, and I said, I'm getting ready to go live to paint... Uh, the backside of a bunny. <laughs> Jump on if you want to watch. So, um, those people that have the uh, text, 
um, knew I was going to jump on here. So uh, a lot of folks uh, already already took advantage of that. So um, definitely do, definitely do, um, because it's um, even if like you're you know at the mall shopping or I don't know if people even do that these days or if you're out doing whatever and you're busy at ball practice with your kids or whatever you're doing uh, and you're like oh shoot I can't don't have time to do that now at least you'll be reminded of it and you'll know of it and then you can go back and watch it later so if it's something that you want to paint or you want to watch you know and learn to to paint so hey dude welcome Yes, Tanya, the sales are exciting. They're very exciting. Uh, they're a lot of fun, and um, I sell a lot of paintings uh, when I have them because um, they're a really good deal. They're a very good deal. I just have so many. I just, I, I can't have all these. I don't have room to store all of them. I don't. So, um, I have a lot of sales to move them out of here. So, um, that's that. Yeah. Pretty cool stuff. All right. Well, you guys have a wonderful, wonderful evening. Um, I will, um, I don't even know what day it is. It's Monday. I'll be back on here again on Thursday, uh, going live on here on Thursday. Um, and I have no idea what I'm going to be doing. Maybe we'll add something else to this bunny painting. Who knows? Um, if you all have ideas of what you'd like for me to add to the bunny painting, put it in the comments and we'll see what we can come up with. It'll be fun. All right. Y'all have a good evening. I'll see you back on here again on Thursday. Take care. God bless you guys. Uh, appreciate you all so much. Thanks for joining me. And have a good one. See you next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.